Hey everyone, Rosie Annette here with Brushes, Biceps, and Bites, and today I'm going to unbox my Love With Food box as well as my Graze box. These are just subscription boxes. Love With Food comes once a month. I believe it's $10, and for every box you buy, you donate a meal to a family in need. And I will have links for both of these down below. They are um, referral links, so I do get credit to my account, but they're not sponsoring me to make this video. It's just like a referral link for Erin Condren or anything like that, and you can also get your first box for free by using my referral link for both boxes. Um, Love with food, I'll just open it up and show you, comes. This, bun this month's box is Fiesta Fiesta. Comes with a pamphlet about all the food and comes with a bunch of different snack options from a bunch of different brands that I'm just dumping all over the floor. Okay, Gray's box is, I think, it, I think it gets delivered every two weeks. This is only my second box. This has eight different snacks in it and they are all from their own brand. Let me set this down before I dump everything out. It comes with the little card inside of it as well. These aren't themed, but the little card has the nutritional information for all the snacks and then it comes with a layer of four little snacks and you can see there's another layer of four down below they're in these little clear containers like so and you can see exactly what's in them so two different options of boxes and i think the box of eight for grays is twelve dollars so let's just dig right in i'm going to start with the love with food box if i can not get tongue tied right now. The first thing I see are these home free mini lemon burst cookies. They are gluten free, nut free, whole grain, non GMO project verified. This little container is only 50 calories, although it's more of a bag than a container, but you know, technicalities. And the next thing I see is this schmooze coconut pink guava fruit ice. It says serve frozen. This kind of reminds me of holes with like the canned peaches when they're under the boat, if you guys know what I'm talking about. This might be a super good um, summer snack, like popsicle that's actually healthy for you idea. 70 calories in this little thing and I'll try to leave links to every product that they put in these boxes with all the nutritional information so I don't have to read it all off to you guys and this isn't like an hour long. <laughs> the next thing I see are these PB Thins peanut butter crackers, a kosher product, only 100 calories, all natural, no preservatives, non or GMO free as well. Um, I'm really curious if this is made by the same brand that makes PB2 because this is kind of like the same font. But anyways, really interested about these things. They look very interesting. Next, I see this little stick tight doodad. It says Vintage B um, Creamed Honey with Hibiscus. This will be good on like yogurt and granola or maybe even some oatmeal. Then I see these Education in Every Bite, Dick and Jane Baking Company, Smart Educational Snacks, English and Spanish. Oh, interesting. So they have little pictures of things, like the one up here, and it says one and uno. So these are like, that's like really a cool idea to give to kids. I wonder how good they taste. The next thing I see are these two like little candy doodads. The blue one or the minty one says organic iced mint mango. And the purple one says organic blood orange. I wonder how these compare to Jolly Ranchers because I secretly love Jolly Ranchers. So if I can find a healthy organic alternative, that would be amazing. The next thing I see are these Inca corn chips. These, were, these remind me of like those corn bites that are in the grocery store. God, I haven't had them forever. I don't even remember what they're called. But um, there's 180 calories in this package. And look how big the corn is. Then the last thing of food in here are these better chips. The flavor inside. Spinach, kale, chips, non-GMO, verified, gluten-free, 140 calories per serving. There's two servings in this bag. 
So I'm a little skeptical about these. I'm not the biggest fan of spinach, so I might be opening this with my mom, and depending on how I feel, she might be getting a free snack. Also, in the bottom of the box, there were, was a Better Chips pamphlet, um, as well as coupon for buy one, get one free at the bottom, and then there's also a $100 wine voucher. So now on to Gray's box. Again, I will try to leave the links to everything down below from the box so I'm not sitting here like reading everything off. The first thing I see are Garden of, Eng of England is what it is called. It's mini strawberry soft pineapple pieces and black currants. It says only seven ca 70 calories and one serving of fruit in here. And it's really cool because you can actually see like everything that's in it. The next thing I see is called Pecan Power. Pecan, strawberries, and almonds are in this one. This one doesn't have the calories on the front, so I'll just tell you that. 200 per container. It looks like a big, like a good nut mixture. This one's called Barbecue Sub with a barbecue relish dip. Only 80 calories. There's like these little breadstick type things to dip on the side. So that seems like a yummy treat. The next thing I see are these summer berry flapjacks, rustic rolled oats flapjacks with berries and cranberries. There's 230 calories in these. These just look like little granola bars. They're super cute. In the, oh my god, I just saw something and got really excited. In the next layer, there are, it's called beach bum. That's interesting. On the package, it says that there is 90 calories. But then on the little um, pamphlet, it says, I don't even know if you can see this. It says that there's 100 calories. So I'm really curious as to which one's right. It says that there's pineapple, coconut flakes, and chewy banana coins. Again, I'm not the biggest fan of coconut, so these might be going to my mom. But the good news is, is with Gray's box, like if I don't like this and I can't get past the coconut, I can go online and find this snack under my account and tell them to not send it to me again. So that's super nice. So if there's something you're allergic to, it won't be put in your box and all that stuff. So I'll try anything once. I'm going to save the thing I'm most excited for for last. The next I see is this Herbie Baked Bread, Basil, Baguettes, Garlic, Croissante, and Oregano Rice Cakes. That's what it looks like on the back. Isn't their labeling like super cute? I think it's super cute. There's 90 calories in this little guy. Next, I see hickory smoked barbecue, barbecue peas, hickory smoked cashews, and corn nuts. Corn nuts. That's what those things were called um, in this store. Corn nuts. Hello. Um, anyways, 140 calories in this one. It looks super yummy. There's a good combination with this box too, uh, salty and savory. That's the same thing. I meant sweet and savory. And the last thing that I am most excited for are these iced Cinnabon box. Ooh, glaring you. Sorry about that. There are cinnamon, honey, almonds, yogurt, sunflower seeds, and vanilla cookie drops and 150 calories. I love me some cinnamon rolls, so I really hope that this is good. So that is it for these two boxes. And if you guys have any questions or anything or get any other food subscription boxes that are similar to this that you think I should try out and maybe review, please comment down below. I love talking to you guys and interacting with you guys and hearing from you all. Um... And please, if you haven't already subscribed, I have a lot of makeup videos planned and a lot of other food videos, including a what I eat in a day that I'm in the middle of editing coming out. So if you could please subscribe, it would mean the world to me and then you won't miss anything coming out. I hope you guys have a great day, night, evening, wherever you are, whenever you're watching this. And I will talk to you guys in my next one. Bye.